On what date did Nunavut become a territory? A. July 1st, 1867 B. April 1st, 1999 C. June 24th, 1995 D. March 31st, 1949 Correct answer is B. April 1st, 1999 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 19 what year did Newfoundland and Labrador join Canada? A. 1867 B. 1955 C. 1949 D. 1880 Correct answer is C. 1949 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 19 What year was Confederation? A. 1867 B. 1871 C. 1898 D. 1864 Correct answer is A. 1867 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 18 When did the name Canada start appearing on maps? A. 1980 B. 1880 C. 1550 D. Early 1600s Correct answer is C. 1550 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 14. When did the British North America Act come into effect? A. 1871 B. 1898 C. 1867 D. 1905 Correct answer is C. 1867 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 18. When did the Canadian Charter of Rights and Freedoms become part of the Canadian Constitution? A. 1867 B. 1905 C. 1982 D. 1878 Correct answer is C. 1982 When is Canada Day and what does it celebrate? A. June 15th of each year to celebrate the anniversary of Confederation. B. August 8th of each year to celebrate the joining of British Columbia to Confederation. C. We celebrate the anniversary of Confederation July 1st of each year. D. May 21st of each year to remember Queen Victoria. Correct answer is C. We celebrate the anniversary of Confederation July 1st of each year. When is Remembrance Day celebrated? A. July 1st B. October 1st C. November 11th D. December 25th Correct answer is C. November 11th When must federal elections be held? A. About every four years B. On the third Monday in October every four years following the most recent general election. C. Whenever the Prime Minister calls the election. D. When the MPs want a new Prime Minister. Correct answer is B. On the third Monday in October every four years following the most recent general election. How long is the Governor General's term of office? A. Five years. B. Four years. C. 3 years D. 6 years Correct answer is A. 5 years Discover Canada Study Guide, page 29 Which act granted, for the first time in Canada, legislative assemblies elected by the people? A. The Constitutional Act of 1867 B. The Constitutional Act of 1791 C. The Constitutional Act of 1982 D. The Constitutional Act of 2010 Correct answer B. The Constitutional Act of 1791 For how many years, settlers and immigrants have contributed to the diversity and richness of Canada, which is built on a proud history and a strong identity? A. For 500 years B for 400 years C for 300 years D for 200 years Correct answer is B for 400 years Discover Canada Study Guide, page 3 When was 
Magna Carta signed in England. A 1867. B 1869. C 1215. D 1218. Correct answer. C 1215. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 8. When was Constitution of Canada was amended to entrench the Canadian Charter of Rights and Freedoms? A. 1982 B. 1867 C. 1215 D. 1869 Correct answer A. 1982 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 8 when was territorial rights were first guaranteed through the Royal Proclamation by King George III? A. 1800 B. 1790 C. 1862 D. 1763 Correct answer D. 1763 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 10 when did federal government place many Aboriginal children in residential schools to educate and assimilate them into mainstream Canadian culture? A. 1800s to 1980s B. 1700s to 1800s C. 1780s to 1860s D. 1800s to 1900s Correct answer A. 1800s to 1980s Discover Canada Study Guide, page 10 in which year, Ottawa formally apologized to the former Aboriginal students? A. 1900 B. 2000 C. 2008 D. 2006 Correct answer is C. 2008 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 10 When was the term First Nations began to be used? A. In the 16th of Antilles B in the 1970s, C in the 1770s, D1 and the 1870s. Correct answer is B in the 1970s. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 10. Today about how many communities, about half of First Nations people live on reserve land? A 900, B 600, C 700. D500 Correct answer is B600 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 10 About how much percent of the Aboriginal people are First Nations? A65% B50% C70% D60% Correct answer is A65% Discover Canada Study Guide, page 11. About how much percent of the Aboriginal people are Métis? A. 40%. B. 20%. C. 30%. D. 10%. Correct answer is C. 30%. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 11. About how much percent of the Aboriginal people are Inuit? A 2%, B 4%, C 3%, D 5%. Correct answer is B 4%. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 11. Today, what population of Canada are Anglophones people who speak English as a first language? A 18 million, B 16 million, C 10 million. D 15 million. Correct answer is A 18 million. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 11. Today, what population of Canada are Francophones people who speak French as their first language? A 10 million. B 8 million. C 7 million. D 9 million. Correct answer is C 7 million. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 11. When did Acadians began to settle in maritime provinces? A. 1700 B. 1604 C. 1605 D. 1650 Correct answer is B. 1604 
Discover Canada Study Guide, page 11. During war between Britain and France, when was more than two-thirds of the Acadians were deported from their homeland? A. 1755-1763 B. 1750-1763 C. 1763-1783 D. 1850-1875 Correct answer is a. 1755-1763 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 11 Which year the House of Commons recognized that the Quebecois form a nation within a united Canada? A. 2008 B. 2005 C. 2006 D. 2000 Correct answer is C. 2006 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 11. One million Anglo-Quebecers have a heritage of dash years and form a vibrant part of the Quebec fabric. A200 B250 C280 D300 Correct answer is B250 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 11. Quebecers are descendants of Dash French settlers. A8000 B8500 C8700 D9000 Correct answer is B8500 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 11. Quebecers are descendants of French settlers from Dash to Dash. A1700s to 1800s B 1500s to 1700s, C 1500s to 1600s, D 1600s to 1700s. Correct answer is D 1600s to 1700s. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 11. From when most immigrants have come from Asian countries? A 1950s, B 1970s. C. 1990s D. 1980s Correct answer is B. 1970s Discover Canada Study Guide, page 12 The majority of Canadians were born in this country and this has been true since when? A. 1700s B. 1800s C. 1600s D. 1500s Correct answer is B 1800s Discover Canada Study Guide, page 12 Over the past dash years, millions of newcomers have helped to build and defend a way of life in Canada. A 200 B 300 C 100 D 500 Correct answer is A 200 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 12 the life in English-speaking areas was established by English, Welsh, Scottish and Irish settlers, soldiers, and migrants from Dash to the 20th century. A. 1700s B. 1500s C. 1600s D. 1800s Correct answer is C. 1600s Discover Canada Study Guide, page 12 In Vancouver what percent of the population speak Chinese languages at home? A10 B12 C11 D13 Correct answer is D13 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 13 In Toronto, what percent of the population speak Chinese languages at home? A5 B7 C6 D3 Correct answer is B7 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 13 When did European exploration began in earnest with the expedition of John Cabot? A. in 1497 B. in 1947 C. in 1450 D. in 1490 Correct answer is a. In 1497. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 14. 
Aboriginals and Europeans formed strong economic, religious, and military bonds in the first dash years of coexistence which laid the foundations of Canada. A100 B300 C200 D150 Correct answer is C200 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 14. How many years ago the Vikings from Iceland who colonized Greenland also reached Labrador and the island of Newfoundland? A2000 B1000 C500 D1500 Correct answer is B1000 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 14. From when? The name of Canada began appearing on maps. A by the 1500s. B by the 1550s. C by the 1600s. D by the 1650s. Correct answer is B by the 1550s. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 14. Between 1534 and Dash, Jacques Cartier made three voyages across the Atlantic claiming the land for King Francis I of France. A1600 B1642 C1500 D1542 Correct answer is D1542 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 14 When did French and the Iroquois made peace? A1601 B1701 C1801 D1501 Correct answer is B1701 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 15 When did British Parliament pass the Quebec Act? A1554 B1884 C1664 D1774 Correct answer is D1774. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 15. How many black loyalists, freedmen, and slaves came north seeking a better life? A1000. B2000. C3000. D4000. Correct answer is C3000. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 15. How many Loyalists fled the oppression of the American Revolution to settle in Nova Scotia and Quebec? A30,000 B40,000 C50,000 D20,000 Correct answer is B40,000 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 15 when did the 13 British colonies to the south of Quebec declared independence and formed the United States? A. 1566 B. 1666 C. 1776 D. 1466 Correct answer is C. 1776 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 15 When did some black Nova Scotians were given poor land, moved on to establish Freetown, Sierra Leone, West Africa, a new British colony for freed slaves. A 1592 B 1892 C 1692 D 1792 Correct answer is D 1792 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 15 when did King Charles II of England granted the Hudson's Bay Company exclusive trading rights over the watershed draining into Hudson Bay? A. 1670 B. 1570 C. 1470 D. 1770 Correct answer is A. 1670 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 15 when did British defeated the French in the Battle of the Plains of Abraham at Quebec City marking the end of France's empire in America? A. 1859 B. 1659 C. 1759 D. 1559 Correct answer is C. 1659 
C1759. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 15. When did France and Great Britain battle for control of North America? A. 1600s. B. 1700s. C. 1800s. D. 1900s. Correct answer is B. 1700s. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 15. English colonies along the Atlantic seaboard, dating from the early dash, eventually became richer and more populous than New France. A. 1600s. B. 1700s. C. 1800s. D. 1900s. Correct answer is A. 1600s. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 15. When did the first European settlement north of Florida was established by French explorers Pierre de Monts and Samuel de Champlain? A. 1704 B. 1504 C. 1604 D. 1804 Correct answer is C. 1604 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 15 which year Champlain built a fortress at what is now Quebec City? A. 1704 B. 1508 C. 1604 D. 1608 Correct answer is D. 1608 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 15 Count Frontenac refused to surrender Quebec to the English in dash A. 1690 B1890, C1590, D1990. Correct answer is A1690. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 15. When did Sir Guy Carleton, Lord Dorchester, as governor of Quebec, defended the rights of the Canadians, defeated an American military invasion of Quebec? A1675. B1775 C1575 D1875 Correct answer is B1775 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 15 When did Sir Guy Carleton, Lord Dorchester, supervise the Loyalist migration to Nova Scotia and Quebec? A1682-1683 B1782 to 1783 C1772 to 1773 D1762 to 1763 Correct answer is B1782 to 1783 Discover Canada Study Guide page 15 When did the first elected assembly of Lower Canada in Quebec City debates whether to use both French and English a. January 20, 1793 B. January 1, 1793 C. January 21, 1793 D. January 2, 1793 Correct answer is C. January 21, 1793 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 16 when was the first representative assembly was elected in Halifax, Nova Scotia? A. 1773 B. 1758 C. 1785 D. 1791 Correct answer is B. 1758 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 16 When was the first representative assembly was elected in Prince Edward Island? A. 1773 B. 1758 C. 1785 D. 1791 Correct answer is A. 1773 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 16 When was the first representative assembly was elected in New Brunswick? A. 1773 B. 1758 C. 1785 D. 1791 Correct answer is C. 1773 
C1785. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 16. The Constitutional Act of Dash divided the province of Quebec into Upper Canada, later Ontario. A1773. B1758. C1785. D1791. Correct answer is D1791. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 16. When did the first movement to abolish the transatlantic slave trade emerged in the British Parliament? A late 1800s. B late 1900s. C late 1700s. D late 2000s. Correct answer is C late 1700s. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 16. When did the British Parliament prohibited the buying and selling of slaves? A. 1907 B. 1507 C. 1607 D. 1807 Correct answer is D. 1807 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 16 When did the British Parliament abolished slavery throughout the Empire? A. 1833 B. 1633 C. 1533 D. 1933 Correct answer is A. 1833 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 16 In which year, Upper Canada, led by Lieutenant Governor John Graves Simcoe, a Loyalist military officer, became the first province in the Empire to move toward abolition? A. 1793 B. 1892 C. 1697 D. 2006 Correct answer is A. 1793 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 16 When did the Montreal Stock Exchange opened? A. 1793 B. 1832 C. 1685 D. 1690 Correct answer is B. 1832 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 16 Believing it would be easy to conquer Canada, in which year United States launched an invasion? A. 1872 B. 1812 C. 1876 D. 1920 Correct answer is B. 1812 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 17. In which year Americans burned Government House and the Parliament buildings in York, now Toronto? A. 1872 B. 1812 C. 1876 D. 1813 Correct answer is D. 1813 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 17. In which year Major General Robert Ross led an expedition from Nova Scotia that burned down the White House and other public buildings in Washington? A. 1814 B. 1812 C. 1876 D. 1813 Correct answer is A. 1814 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 17 in which year Lieutenant Colonel Charles de Salaberry and 460 soldiers, mostly French Canadians, turned back 4,000 American invaders at Chateauguay, south of Montreal? A. 1814 B. 1812 C. 1876 D. 1813 Correct answer is D. 1813 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 17 when did Upper and Lower Canada were united as the province of Canada? A. 1814 B. 1812 C. 1840 D. 1813 Correct answer is C. 1840 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 18 When did the Fathers of Confederation establish the Dominion of Canada? A. July 1, 1814 B. July 1st 1867 C. July 1st, 1857 D. 
July 1st, 1897? Correct answer is B. July 1st, 1867. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 18. When is Dominion Day celebrated? A. July 1st B. January 1st C. June 1st D. May 1st Correct answer is A. July 1st Discover Canada Study Guide, page 18. When was the term Dominion of Canada suggested by Sir Leonard Tilley? A. 1864 B. 1897 C. 1890 D. 1850 1864 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 18 When did King George V assign Canada's national colors, white and red, the colors of our national flag today? A. 1864 B. 1921 C. 1920 D. 1900 Correct answer is B. 1921 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 18. When did Sir Louis Hippolyte Lafontaine became the first head of a responsible government, similar to a prime minister, in Canada? A. 1864 B. 1921 C. 1849 D. 1879 Correct answer is C. 1849 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 18. When is the expansion of the Dominion in Ontario, Quebec, Nova Scotia, New Brunswick? A. 1871 B. 1870 C. 1867 D. 1873 Correct answer is C. 1867 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 19. When is the expansion of the Dominion in Manitoba, Northwest Territories? A. 1871 B. 1870 C. 1867 D. 1873 Correct answer is B. 1870 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 19 When is the expansion of the Dominion in British Columbia? A. 1871 B. 1870 C. 1867 D. 1873 A. 1871 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 19 When is the expansion of the Dominion in Prince Edward Island? A. 1871 B. 1870 C. 1867 D. 1873 Correct answer is D. 1873 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 19 When is the expansion of the Dominion in transfer of the Arctic Islands? A. 1871 B. 1870 C. 1880 D. 1873 Correct answer is C. 1880 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 19 when is the expansion of the Dominion in Yukon Territory? A. 1871 B. 1870 C. 1880 D. 1898 Correct answer is D. 1898 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 19 When is the expansion of the Dominion in Alberta, Saskatchewan? A. 1871 B. 1905 C. 1880 D. 1898 Correct answer is B. 1905 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 19 When is the expansion of the Dominion in Newfoundland and Labrador? A. 1949 B. 1905 C. 1880 D. 1898 Correct answer is A. 1949 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 19 When is the expansion of the Dominion in Nunavut? A. 1949 B. 1905 
B1905, C1999, D1898. Correct answer is C1999. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 19. When did Sir John Alexander Macdonald, a father of Confederation, became Canada's first Prime Minister? A. 1949 B. 1905 C. 1867 D. 1898 Correct answer is C. 1867 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 19 When did Sir John Alexander Macdonald born? A. January 11, 1815 B. January 1, 1815 C. January 20, 1815 D. January 15, 1815 Correct answer is A. January 11, 1815 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 19 When is Sir John Alexander Macdonald Day? A. January 11, 1815 B. January 1, 1815 C. January 20, 1815 D. January 15, 1815 Correct answer is A. January 11, 1815 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 19 When did Canada took over the vast northwest region from the Hudson's Bay Company? A. 1850 B. 1869 C. 1890 D. 1889 Correct answer is B. 1869 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 19 In which year Ottawa sent soldiers to retake Fort Gary? A. 1850 B. 1869 C. 1870 D. 1889 Correct answer is C. 1870 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 19. When did the Second Rebellion started in present-day Saskatchewan led to Riel's trial and execution for high treason? A. 1850 B. 1885 C. 1870 D. 1889 Correct answer is B. 1885 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 19. When is Northwest Mounted Police, NWMP, established by Prime Minister Macdonald? A. 1850 B. 1885 C. 1870 D. 1873 Correct answer is D. 1873 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 19 When did members of the train crew pose with the westbound Pacific Express, at the first crossing of the Illisilwayat River near Glacier. A. 1850 B. 1885 C. 1886 D. 1873 Correct answer is C. 1886 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 20 When did a powerful symbol of unity was completed when Donald Smith, Lord Strathcona, Director of the Canadian Pacific Railway, CPR, drove the last spike. A. November 7, 1850 B. November 7, 1885 C. November 7, 1886 D. November 7, 1873 Correct answer is B. November 7, 1885 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 20 when did the Government of Canada apologize for the discriminatory head tax policy? A. 2008 B. 2006 C. 2009 D. 2005 Correct answer is B. 2006 Discover Canada Study Guide, page 20 When did Railway made it possible for immigrants to settle in the West? A. Before 1918 B. Before 1914 C. Before 1916 D. Before 1919 Correct answer is B. Before 
24, 1914. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 20. When did First World War started? A. 1918. B. 1916. C. 1914. D. 1919. Correct answer is C. 1914. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 21. How many Canadians has participated in Boer War? A. More than 70,000. B. More than 60,000. C. More than 80,000. D. More than 50,000. Correct answer is B. More than 60,000. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 21. When did Canadian Corps captured Vimy Ridge? A. June 1917. B. March 1917. C. January 1917. D. April 1917. Correct answer is D. April 1917. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 21. When is Vimy Day celebrated? A. June 9th. B. March 9th. C. January 9th. D. April 9th. Correct answer is D. April 9th. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 21. When is the Black Day of the German Army? A. June 8, 1918. B. August 8, 1918. C. January 8, 1918. D. April 8, 1918. Correct answer is B. August 8, 1918. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 21. When was First World War ended? A. November 11, 1918. B. November 11, 1916. C. November 11, 1919. D. November 11, 1917. Correct answer is A. November 11, 1918. Discover Canada Study Guide, page 21. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to our channel for more interesting videos.